So here is my HP 41CX with a card reader attached. So I got this card reader and it had the standard uh, gummy wheel problem. And so I took these O-rings and uh, you know popped the thing open. It's really easy to get at the motor and whatnot. Uh, replaced the wheels. And uh, you know the clutch is good, the sensor is good, and now the wheel is good. The thing works perfectly. Uh, and I'm thinking of selling this guy on eBay now. Uh, I'll go ahead and sell it with the uh, manual and with a pack of ten of these uh, magnetic cards. But to demonstrate how to use it, most, most often it's used to store programs. You can also store the registers, you can store the entire state of the, the device if you'd like. But here's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's go into program mode and uh, go to the end here. And uh, maybe make a new label just so we can see what we're doing. Call it high. And uh, maybe I'll just, you know, I don't know, push one, two, three on the stack. It's not important that it does anything useful, but uh, just that we can write some program. So now the program's in there, you know, you can, of course, execute that. Dink, pushes one, two, three on the stack. So what you do to write the program to the card is go back to program mode and uh, go to that label just to line everything up. So now it's at that label and just simply run a card through it. It'll, it'll write everything from that label down to the uh, end onto the card. That's it. And then you can label the card and whatnot. But uh, now to demo reading it back, I can actually just blow away the entire device just so we can really prove that it's working properly here. So there you go. Memory lost. There's nothing in the machine. Our, uh, you know, our program does not exist. Non-existent, but all we got to do is in normal mode just run the card back through, and voila! Now the thing really ought to exist, and there it is. It pushes one, two, three on the stack. Now uh, you can also do key assignments and then uh, switch to user mode when you run the card through to read it back, and it'll reassign the the keys, and it's pretty nice. So this is a nice working uh, card reader. Now, to be honest, I'm going to sell this on eBay, so I want to demo a little bit. You know, the thing had been opened up by somebody else with a screwdriver or something. They cracked the, the frame of the thing there, so I've super glued it. But, uh, you know, besides the cosmetic problems there, the thing functions perfectly. Um, I should turn this off before I do this, but I detach it. It just plugs into port 4. Nice little card reader.